Gospel of John 12, verses 30 to 36, where Jesus speaks about his death. Now there were some Greeks among those who went up to, to worship at the festival. They came to Philip with a request. Sir, we want to see Jesus. Philip went to, to tell Andrew, and they both went to tell Jesus. The hour has come for the Son of Man to be glorified. Very truly, I tell you, unless a, gra a grain of wheat falls to the ground, it remains only a single seed. But if it dies, it produces many seeds. Anyone who loves their life will lose it. While anyone who hates their life in this world will keep it it will keep it for eternal life. Whoever serves me must follow me, and where I am, my servant will also be. My Father will honor the ones who serve me. Now my soul is troubled. What should I say? Should I say, Father, save me from this hour? No. It was for this reason I came to this hour. Father, glorify your name. Then a voice spoke from heaven. I have glorified it, and it will, and it will glorify again. The crowd that was there, some said it had thundered wild, others said an angel spoke to them. The light is with you for, for a little longer. Oh. The voice has come for your sake. Not for my, not for mine, not for me. Now is the is now is the judgment of the world. Now the ruler of this world will be driven out. Will be driven out. And, and when I am lifted up from the earth, I will draw all people to me. We have heard from the Lord that the Messiah remains forever. How can you say that the Son of Man must be lifted up? Who is the Son of Man? The light is a few. Oh. The light is a few for a little longer. Walk while you have the light, so that the darkness may not overtake you. If you walk in darkness, you do, you do not know where you are going. Well, you have the light. Well, you have the light. Believe in the light so that you, so, so that you may become children of light.